Hi friends, in this video, we are going to see what is a triac and how it works. We'll also make some example circuit to better understand how triac works. So without further ado, let's start this video. If you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notified about my new videos. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram. I have a second channel Canny Tech, do check it out as well. Subscribe and support it. All the links are in the description. Trike is a three-terminal device that conduct electric current in both direction when triggered. Trike is most commonly used semiconductor device for switching and power control of AC systems as the trike can be switched on by either a positive or a negative gate pulse regardless of the polarity of the AC supply at that time. This makes trike ideal to control a lamp or AC motor load with a very basic trike switching circuit. Trike comes in different packages. This is the construction diagram of a trike. This is the equivalent circuit of trike made with two SCRs. This is the symbol of trike. When we give AC signal at the input of a trike, there is no signal at the output until we give a trigger at the gate. When we trigger the gate, we will have the output signal. The output signal of trike will change by the gate triggering angle. This is a basic switching circuit of trike. We have used a push button to turn on and off the trike and we have connected a lamp as the load. When we press the push button, the trike turns on so that the lamp turns on and when we release the button the lamp goes off. Now let's make some example circuits to better understand the working of trike. This is an SSR circuit made with trike. We have also used an optocoupler to isolate the low voltage signal from the high voltage AC signal so that we can use a microcontroller or a low voltage electronic circuit. Let's see how it works. In this example, we have made a digital lamp dimmer with Arduino. Let's see how it works. In this example, we have made a single phase AC motor speed controller with Arduino. Let's see how it works.
So that's it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed this video. For more videos like that, stay tuned and I will see you in the next video.